Why, hello there. It is I, the Cheesy Cat, and this is Platoon 2 Octo Canyon, another video where I do all the searching for you so you can save your time playing the game. We're here in Beaker's Depot, and we're going to start looking for these sunken scrolls and sardinium and some tickets if we can find them. So either way, this is what the completion looks like for Sector 3. Beaker's Depot. We're gonna get right into the sunken scroll. If you go right into the middle of Beaker's Depot after jumping off the rail, look to your left and you'll see balloons. Well, one balloon, that is your ink color. You already know how this works. Shoot it and you'll be led to a bunch of other balloons. Now the tricky part is right here where you'll have to jump off and then go to that balloon. I somehow got it on my first try, but you may not. I know I've messed up multiple times on other ones, but this is just to show you where the balloons will end up, and you get your sunken scroll, which is one of the stickers for the area. Next up, we're going to get that sardinium, and right here I catch a glimpse of the orange box from this area, because I spent about five minutes looking for it. So you're going to go to level 13, jump there or find it, it's basically to the right side and it's going to be on top of these tower structures and you kind of just climb up jump over sardinium obtained level 10 octo seeker shakedown is going to be our first level of the video in this area when you come into this place where there's like a quad of sponges right under it are some more sponges kind of found it on accident so here I am going down, and there you have it. Two boxes, and one of them contains a sucking scroll. The next one is going to be a ticket, I believe. There's an area that you cannot ink. Basically, you just go on top of the seeker, the octo seeker, and the ticket is right there. It's a cash ticket. Just remember the area that you can't ink the floor. The Sardinium's gonna be right before the Zapfish, like just before it. So skip the jump point, skip this Octo Seeker. Sardinium is yours. There's a new fish in the sea. Come check out the Shoal. The most entertaining destination in Inkopolis is now open. So that's an ad for the Shoal, local multiplayer. Next up is a floating garden. We're gonna meet up with a new enemy here, but before we get into that, just recognize this area and there will be a trench where you have a puddle of ink reveal that a box is hidden in there and you get the experience ticket. Next up is this wide open area with lots of places to fall down. Find some octo rings. You can probably see them from where you first start. But there's a tentacook dropping down through those rings and it has the sunken scroll. The sardinium is in plain sight. But you need a key to get into the box. So grab the two keys by killing all the tentacooks around. And you should have the sardinium. Major changes to regulations by the power that be have led to a call for the complete replacement and overhaul of all special weapons. Designers and manufacturers are struggling to comply with this new regulation. We have Octo Resort Spring up next. Here, we're going to meet our first Flutter. Just lure him over to the left side, and you can paint the wall that's all along here. Just don't get killed by the Flutter, and you'll get the Sardinium for that level. Next up, we're going to have another Flutter. This time, just lure him to the right side. And you'll want to paint that wall just behind him. It's not up there, but right here I'm going to be searching for like wherever hidden stuff is. But it's to the left side. There's an inkable wall up top. Jump on the flutter, ink the wall, and get your sunken scroll. These must be photographs taken by some young adult inklings. Are these so-called twinklings? trying to convince their peers that their lives are exciting and full of meaning or are they trying to convince themselves kind of a low blow if you ask me <laughs> next up we have dancing floors in this stage you're going to be required to use the splatling 
but this ink switch right here with this kind of staircase of platforms right to the top left you'll see a box and you may have noticed this yourself if you played this level yet but you just climb up there get your sardinium pretty easy next may not be quite as apparent as first but it involves flutters again you're going to lure one of the flutters towards you and you can see a grapple right above so you're gonna lure it and hit that grapple with right timing and you should land on top of the flutter which can move you towards the box to get you your sunken scroll The most fashionable gear is crafted with the latest in textile, textile technology. Heating materials to produce smooth curves or distressing stiff fabrics to increase suppleness and change their look are common techniques. Our next level is the parking garage and you're going to be required to use the sniper in this stage. For the sunken scroll, it's going to be in the place where the octo sniper is. Just kind of drop down on this area. I found it on accident. The experience ticket is in plain sight, but you have to go around to grab it. As for the Sardinium, on the roof of this area, it'll be in an easy spot. You just have to make sure you don't miss it. And for anyone who's stuck in this area, who doesn't know where the door to unlock is, it's just two floors down and you'll find it. The latest research has produced startling revelations about Inkling Ink. Once thought to simply disappear after a while, Inkling Ink is actually rapidly disintegrated by airborne microbes. Octoling Assault. Up next, we have another stage with Octolings. And if you haven't noticed, they're actual stages. So we have Humpback Pump Track. I grab a key here um, just to show you where one of the key is. The other key is going to be in the middle of the stage, the very middle. All the items are in the enemy base. So on the left side or the right side, if you're facing towards the middle of the stage, is going to be the coin ticket on the left side. That's what one of the keys are for, the sunken scroll. The sardinium, you just shoot at the box to grab it. Don't slip up and miss the new album by Wet Floor on sale now. Their style changes like the shifting tides of ink in a battle. Full color or monochromatic, smooth or staccato, or lush and dripping with sound, it's rock for a new generation. And that about does it. This is the completion for Sector 3, Beaker's Depot, and of course the Sardinium for the boss is obtained just by defeating it. Either way, if you liked the video, hit that like button, comment below if you have any questions, and subscribe to catch all these new Splatoon videos coming out right at you guys. This is the Cheesy Cat, and I'll see you in the next video.